the history of human virus research dates back to the early 20th century. Albrecht Kossel, a German scientist, discovered the basic chemical structures of nucleic acids with a couple of students. Their scientific findings were later used by the Nazis to study the secret of human genome, which served as the theoretical basis for the development of biological warfare. Germany deployed mass chlorine gas against France in the Second Battle of Ypres. This was the very first usage of bioweapons in the human history. A signature in a train carriage made on November 11th, 1918. However, Germany did not stop the research of bioweapons during the World War II, and the related technologies were soon learned by Japan. Another fascist Axis power, the Japanese quickly started their own research of bioweapons, established the Unit 731, and carried out germ warfare without restraint. Human experiments were conducted in China, Korea, Russia, and many other countries. The human subjects suffered irreversible damage on their health. In the midst of World War II, Japan deployed numerous plague bombs in the battles against China, which caused mass casualties and greatly reduced fighting capacities of the opponent. During the Pacific Battle, Japan conceived Project Ginma. The Japanese first contracted their women with Ginma virus, then exploited the sexual openness of the U.S. soldiers to infect them via these women after the landing of U.S. Army. The U.S. saw the destructive potential of bioweapons in these battles. Therefore, many resources were funneled into the research of bioweapons in the U.S. On April 15, 1943, a germ warfare research base was established in Fort Detrick, Maryland. 